it's time for another midweek bonanza. So it's a Thursday night and um, I've managed to drag Stu away from the catfish for the night because he wants to try another water on the limb ticket. So I've brought him here to Serpentine for a um, quickie overnighter off for work in the morning. What, um, off for work in the morning, usual script. So yeah, we'd, um, we've jumped on here. There was a few booked on but there's there's only me and Stu on at the moment so I don't know where everyone is. But um, yeah, at the moment we've got Serpentine to ourselves. So when we, um, when we got here, about half five, um, the wind was pushing down to the left and we had a little scoot round before we um, decided to set up and all the fish that we seen were all down this um, left hand quarter of the pond and we hardly seen anything up that side so we chose to fish down this end and I said to Stu which, which swim do you want so he's picked the bay obviously where we see most of the fish um, I said to him yeah you have first dibs you've not been here before but um, since we've got our rods in but half an hour later the, the wind's died down it's gone like a mill pond now and the fish have scattered out scattered around because um, they've started showing in different places which I knew it I knew it happened but just hopefully they come back they're, they're still down there because I've just seen one show in the bay there so they're still here we've seen the odd little swirl and that so they are still here but they have scattered it all might not have scattered a bit but they're showing in other places so, but we're still hopeful, we're still hopeful, hopeful for the fish each. If you've seen any of my other videos, this is like the third time I've been here now in two weeks, just over two weeks. I've done an overnighter on the first bank holiday in May. Um, I had one fish out, if you've seen that. Um, and then I've, I come here last Monday for a day session. Um, pulled out a 20 pounder which was made up with and he had one run I think I got done once as well but yeah he had one run um, that's the 21.3 and then I've come here tonight for a quickie quickie overnighter so I'm just hoping we both get a fish it'd be nice it'd be nice to both get one tonight so as I said I'd managed to um, drag Stu away from the catfish I've levelled his rods up for him because he was getting on my nerves because he was bloody well two mile apart Right I'm not bothered about the tape on his um, on his alarms. I'm not bothered about that, but his his rods were shocking. So where are you fishing, Stu? I've got one just over in that corner. Oh, well, he's got one in the corner there. It's just did in you underarm it in? In line with that uh, sycamore tree. Yeah, yeah. Just and underarmed I've got in. One. Just the other one's over there, over isn't it? There. Yeah. So one on the about three foot from the edge. Yeah, three foot from the bank, straight ahead there. So that's where he's fishing. We've seen quite a few fish, but it was alive before, wasn't it? This, yeah, it this was alive. That was quite enough. Look, it's, it's all over your rod. Yeah, the, the fish are showing there over my right rod, or about ten foot off my Everything right rod. Everything seems to be that way now. Yeah, they'll come back. They'll Sod's come back. Worry. Yeah, they'll come back, Stuart. They have even levelled my handles up here. Look, I've got them. So oh, look at that! Leveled. Proper cat. You. The bay alarms are all the same. Did it do good? You've done well there. That's good, that's Stu. Neater Thanks. than mine. <laughs> <laughs> Shock horror. Today I'm not using solid bags. So yeah, I'll show you what I'm doing now. Yeah, so the reason I'm not using solid bags today is the simple reason is I've got the washing line rig on. So you probably won't be able to see this, but my line is pretty much off the water it does dip in a little bit for about two foot but um yeah i've got a little mark i've got a little um well it's my distance sticks on the other side of the the banking i'm just put a lucky band around them and then tuck the line into the lucky band and and then i've just dropped the rigging to the um to the far margin so there's no line there's not hardly any line in the water um, can't usually do this. I wanted to do this for ages, but because I fish on my own, normally I can't do it because my rods would be unattended. But when I did it, Stu, Stu watched my rods while I went over there, um, set my rods up, and then he did his just so I can try it. So I just want to see what happens when a fish takes it. 
Got a cracking bivvy here, Stu. Lovely um, old school tent. He's a dab hand at the old craft work. I'll show you this. I'll show you this. What his handy work. See if you can spot the repair. I mean, I'll, I'll go slow. You'll never see it. You'll not see it, but I'll go very slow. So see if you can spot. The, You'll never see it. <laughs> see if you can spot the repair. I'll go slow. It's coming up in a minute. If you see it. <laughs> Did you see it? Can you see it? It's quite pretty invisible, isn't it? That's my landing strip for a Boeing 747 <laughs> when it flies over. It's good, Baz. I especially like the way, Stu, you didn't even use matching fabric. <laughs> Well, what's, what's to be matching? It's camouflage, isn't it? It's, yeah. it's tricolour. Oh, it's tricolour, yeah. It's, it's brilliant now. It doesn't have to be green. <laughs> it's um, half past ten now. I'm ready for bed. I oh, can't believe we've not had a run. I I honestly thought, honestly thought we'd get one before we went to sleep. The amount of fish in that bay before, I just thought it, it's a cert. It's a dead cert. Oh, never mind. Anyway, hopefully, hopefully we'll get one before we go home. I'm, I'll be absolutely gutted if we don't. So it'll be the first time I've blanked on here this year. So, anyway, wish us luck. Hopefully, me and you'll get one each or something. Um, hope so. Bit gutted, bit gutted. But anyway, chin up. I'll probably get in bed and get a screaming run as soon as I drop off. But. Hopefully, fingers crossed anyway. Catch you in the morning, or if not before. Didn't like that, did he? No, she's waking up now. Look at me the well. He's other glad we got that then if you haven't married She's going berserk. <laughs> At last we've got one. Oh no, it's not bad as big as I thought it should be. So quite a fatty that. Oh it's a fatty. That's how good it though. <laughs> it's a fatty. Graham with his It's a twenty, innit? Oh yeah, absolutely. Right. Handsome. I don't know how that's much, much sling weighs because it's yours, isn't it? Oh my god it is wooden there. I think it's gonna be a 24, 25 there. 28. 8, 10. No, 28. 28, oh, 28, 6 ish. 28, 6. Right. But, I don't know what that is. Have a look at it, mate. Yeah, let's have a look. Look at this, oh, it's a fatty. It's got a belly on it. Look at that. It's a belter, that, isn't it? Oh, aye. It is a belter. Look at the guts on it. Immaculate. That might be one of the biggest ones in here, that. What was it 28 6? Uh, 28 6. There's a fucking gut on that. I know. It's swallowed a football. <laughs> 2 260. 260. 272, it says there. Uh, yeah, 272. And 28 6, 272, that's 25. I oh, can't work it out, it's just over 25, isn't it? 20, yeah. Good fish, though, isn't it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> what have we got forget. here, Grey? There we go, Stu, is this? What a belting fish! I can't think just pull this out of here. Yeah. Alright, calm down. Jesus. Oh, it is. The belly on it that's made it. So it's just it's on just under 26. I can't work it out. It's too, too, too late and too, it'll too work late it out in the day. morning. It's. Work it out over a bowl of porridge in the morning. Yeah. <laughs> but it's around 26 pounds. I can't even pound, pick it up, it's going mad. Right, here we go. 25 and 3 quarters ish. <laughs> when I'm finally bloody picking up. Oh. oh, yes. Lovely. Look at that. Is it coming alright? Yeah, out? perfect. How good is that? Lovely, mate. Let's feel the weight in that. 
two twenties, two twenties in a few days. Mint, I know. Mint. Your method works anyway, doesn't it? The washing line. Your washing line method. <laughs> yeah, I, had it, I got a couple of beeps, and he went quiet. We must have dropped back, mm. and the next minute it took off, and then just a normal run. Oh god! What a doozy! It's all over it. Hey? I need some water, don't I? I've not got any water handy. Look at that. Lovely job. Cracker. 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 Perfect little vid, that as well. Is it? Cool. Nice. I don't think I'm going to top that tonight, Stu. No. Well, if it's the biggest one in here, there's no I chance. I it's <laughs> going to be one of them anyway. I know there's some 25, or 25 in here and stuff, and that, that must be in it's a common. Yeah. <laughs> What can we say? Perfect. We just need you to get one now, Stu. It might happen, it might happen. It might happen if that's just happened, doesn't it? Yeah. It takes. But you said as well, between 7 o'clock and midnight, and it's 10 to midnight. I know, <laughs> I know. Right. Let's get it back. Yeah. Where you see that fish lay there, <laughs> that's where Graham's foot met its doom God on an icy God. night. <laughs> He's going in again, the dozy bleeder. I should have had the, the camera rolling, should I? When you went skiing down the bank straight in the water. At midnight. Fresh out of your bed. <laughs> Old soggy foot. Make sure I don't do it again. Bloody hell. A lively bugger, that isn't it? Big on the back, on it. Yeah, a lump. Oh, come on. Look at that. One last look at it, Gray. Yes, lovely. Get it back. Go on, go on. Like it. And your big sod. <laughs> there it goes. Oh, it's gone down my welly again. Oh, you fooked it, lad. You fooked it. A wet celebration. <laughs> well done. Oh, made up with that. Absolutely made up with that. What the hell? Wasn't expecting to pull that out tonight, especially. I'd, I'd kind of lost a bit of hope, actually, when I went to bed. I thought, it ain't going to happen this because I was expecting one before it went dark and it, it didn't happen. I thought this ain't going to happen, not going to get a fish tonight. Might get one in the morning or something as we're packing up, but yeah. What a fish, £25.9 it was. Uh, couldn't work it out. I just could not work it out on the back then, I thought. So yeah, I ended up having to use my phone and Googling it. So yeah, £25.9. What a cracking fish for a, for a water this size, Christ. So yeah, two twenties in, in four days. Can't beat that. One Monday, one Thursday. Made up. Um, rods are done anyway. I've redone both of them actually. Thought when it when it kited to the right, because I'm using the washing line rig, and the lines on top of the wall, so it kind of the line went into my other line. Didn't tangle anything. That's past my rod, but I think it knocked it off me um, me me rod rest on the other side out the lackey band. So I ended up just redoing both rods, but yeah, it was well worth it. Well worth it. Oh, I've just watched the I've just watched the um, the video back of me fish, and it looks a little cracker. So yeah, loving it. I've just got to try and get sleep now. It's one o'clock in the morning. And I've got work tomorrow, so somehow I'll have to try and get my head down now. So um, happy days, and I'll probably see you in the morning. But I hope Stu gets a fish. I want him to get a fish before morning. Um, the walkie talkies worked I've got them on us to give him a buzz to film it and um, give us a lift and fair enough to him he did get out of bed actually I, was, I wasn't expecting him to but he did so made up with that makes everything a bit easier and quicker to film and stuff so yeah so we'll catch you in the morning or later on this afternoon uh, later on this afternoon later on tonight and uh, see you in a bit Morning, morning. Six o'clock in the morning, and uh, well, I've just gone off for work. 
a um, bit chilly actually surprised it's a little bit chilly this morning anyway alarm's gone off I was awake anyway I had a crap sleep last night don't know why just in and out waking up all the time wasn't the best well never, never mind um, did have another occurrence about 3 o'clock in the morning last night I got a drop back but there was nothing on when I struck into it I don't know whether I had a misrun something went through my line I don't know uh, I've had the ducks and the girl geese take me out this morning one of my rods because my line's on top of the water it went through and I thought it was a run for a split second I have seen the geese I haven't seen the geese anyway so yeah I'm not sure if I had a missed run last night where I got it dumb, dumb me or something else happened I'm not quite sure Stu's not oh, it's looking a bit of fizzing going on Stu um, never gave me a call so we assume he's had nothing I've not spoke to him yet uh, so just a one fish it was a crack I like so I'm not moaning well worth it still don't think that was the right weight when he wherever it was can't remember 20 25 9 I think still think I've worked that out wrong I'm gonna do it I'm gonna work it out after just for my own benefit because it okay I was thinking about to go in bed last night to go to sleep thinking is that right that is that right and my head was my head was gone I just couldn't work it out now I can't even remember what the scales what the scales were and what the um the way sling was so I'll have a I'll I'll have a little thingy this tonight and re watch it back and work it out properly when my head's there. Right, I'm going to put the kettle on. Uh, I'm going to put the kettle on, wake up, pack up, and go home. So, uh, we've got about an hour, about an hour, hour and a quarter for something else to happen. So, you never know, you might get one last dockings. And here lies a little sleepy lazy ass. A very primitive human. And deaf as a post. One lazy little sod. <laughs> Look at that. Uh, he's waking out of his winter slumber. <laughs> well, Stu, what have you got to say about that session? <laughs> Not seen much of you on this here, have we? It was uh, fish after fish. <laughs> non stop action. Fish after fish hitting me line. <laughs> Rod bending action all night. Non-stop liners all night, just to keep me awake. Oh, well. Keep you awake, I don't think so. What? I don't think it keeps you Feel awake. Tired now, though. I, had, I actually had a you better night's sleep. You only had seven hours sleep, yeah. I had a better night's sleep than I would at home. But I'm yeah. tired. Oh, well. More so because, like, was it ten past six or something like that? As soon as, like, the, the birds started singing, I had a camera shoved in my face. <laughs> I was asleep, my eyeball opened, and I just seen the front of that phone there. <laughs> And I consider that one as a joint effort, Graham, because I was up. You did help me, you did help I me. I was up running I, I was very, I was very surprised that you got up, to be honest. So where are we going next, you? What's your next plan of attack? Uh, You're the boss uh, in these midweek bonanzas. Okay. I think next... Even though I did kind of pick this one, didn't I? Forced you into it. You did, you did. <laughs> I think next we go back to Founders. Founders or Top Pool. Or Top Pool. Whichever is quietest. Yeah, and do Cats and Carp. Right, okay. Sounds Cats sound. and car. Yeah. If we go founders, I'm going to go to try and get some liveies and try yeah. the liveies for, for the cats then. We're going to do a, a, a 24 soon, aren't we? Yeah. And we're going to try and do like a species challenge or something if we can get on founders. That's a lot of bits as well. Yeah, a bit, bit bashing and everything for during the day. So, That'd be good, that. I can't wait for that. Yeah, it'd be good. It'd be good. Hopefully bring me lad. He can, he can do a bit as well. Out. Yeah. So, I'm... Um, well, I think we're going to... Well, I'm packed up. Stu has not started like normal. Uh, again, you'll, you'll see a pattern forming here as the weeks go on. <laughs> You've been packing up since half five, mate. I've been up ten minutes. I know. 
I'm need the off. coffee. As soon as I've had my coffee, the brain will function. Yeah, I've had this moment I've... in time, all I can think about is getting back in bed. I've had two coffees with us, isn't it? Yeah. Right, catch you next time, and thumbs up.